The Romanians Romanian, Romani pronounced R -O -M -N or historically, but now a seldom used regionalism. Rumani, dated exonym, Vlachs are a Romance ethnic group and nation native to Romania, that share a common Romanian culture, ancestry, and speak the Romanian language, the most widespread spoken Eastern Romance language which is descended from the Latin language. According to the 2011 Romanian census, just under 89% of Romania's citizens identified themselves as ethnic Romanians. In one interpretation of the census results in Moldova, the Moldovans are counted as Romanians, which would mean that the latter form part of the majority in that country as well. Romanians are also an ethnic minority in several nearby countries situated in Central, respectively Eastern Europe, particularly in Hungary, Czech Republic, Ukraine including Moldovans, Serbia, and Bulgaria. Today, estimates of the number of Romanian people worldwide vary from 26 to 30 million according to various sources, evidently depending on the definition of the term Romanian, Romanians native to Romania and Republic of Moldova and their afferent diasporas, native speakers of Romanian, as well as other Eastern Romance-speaking groups considered by most scholars as a constituent part of the broader Romanian people, specifically Aromanians, Megleno-Romanians, Istro-Romanians, and Vlachs in Serbia including medieval Vlachs in Croatia, in Bulgaria, or in Bosnia and Herzegovina. History Antiquity Inhabited by the ancient Dacians, part of today's territory of Romania was conquered by the Roman Empire in 106, when Trajan's army defeated the army of Dacia's ruler Wars. The Roman administration withdrew two centuries later, under the pressure of the Goths and Carpi. Two theories account for the origin of the Romanian people. One, known as the Daco-Roman continuity theory, posits that they are descendants of Romans and Romanized indigenous peoples living in the Roman province of Dacia, while the other posits that the Romanians are descendants of Romans and Romanized indigenous populations of the former Roman provinces of Illyria, Mosia, Thrace, and Macedon, and the ancestors of Romanians later migrated from these Roman provinces south of the Danube into the area which they inhabit today. According to the first theory, the Romanians are descended from indigenous populations that inhabited what is now Romania and its immediate environs, Thracians Dacians, Gete, and Roman legionnaires and colonists. In the course of the two wars with the Roman legions, between AD 101-102 and AD 105-106 respectively, the emperor Trajan succeeded in defeating the Dacians and the greatest part of Dacia became a Roman province. The colonization with Roman or Romanized elements, the use of the Latin language and the assimilation of Roman civilization as well as the intense development of urban centers led to the Romanization of part of the autochthonous population in Dacia. This process was probably concluded by the 10th century when the assimilation of the Slavs by the Daco Romanians was completed. According to the South of the Danube origin theory, the Romanians' ancestors, a combination of Romans and Romanized peoples of Illyria, Mosia, and Thrace, moved northward across the Danube River into modern day Romania. Small population groups speaking several versions of Romanian Megleno-Romanian, Istro-Romanian, and Aromanian still exist south of the Danube in Greece, Albania, Macedonia, Bulgaria and Serbia, but it is not known whether they themselves migrated from more northern parts of the Balkans, including Dacia. The south of the Danube theory usually favors northern Albania and or Mosia modern-day Serbia and northern Bulgaria as the more specific places of Romanian ethnogenesis. Small genetic differences were reportedly found among southeastern European Greece, Albania populations and especially those of the Dniester Carpathian Romania, Moldova, Ukraine region. Despite this low level of differentiation between them, tree reconstruction and principal component analyses allowed a distinction between Balkan Carpathian Romanians, Moldovans, Ukrainians, Macedonians and Gagazes and Balkan Mediterranean Greeks, Albanians, Turks population groups. The genetic affinities among Dniester Carpathian and southeastern European populations do not reflect their linguistic relationships. According to the report, the results indicate that the ethnic and genetic differentiations occurred in these regions to a considerable extent independently of each other. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Middle Ages to Early Modern Age. 
During the Middle Ages Romanians were mostly known as Vlachs, a blanket term ultimately of Germanic origin, from the word Walla, used by ancient Germanic peoples to refer to Romance-speaking and Celtic neighbors. Besides the separation of some groups Aromanians, Megleno-Romanians, and Istro-Romanians during the Age of Migration, many Vlachs could be found all over the Balkans, in Transylvania, across Carpathian Mountains as far north as Poland and as far west as the regions of Moravia part of the modern Czech Republic, some went as far east as Volhynia of western Ukraine, and the present-day Croatia where the Morlocks gradually disappeared, while the Catholic and Orthodox Vlachs took Croat and Serb national identity, because of the migrations that followed such as those of Slavs, Bulgars, Hungarians, and Tatars, the Romanians were organized in agricultural communes obsta, developing large centralized states only in the 14th century, when the Danubian principalities of Moldavia and Wallachia emerged to fight the Ottoman Empire. During the late Middle Ages, prominent medieval Romanian monarchs such as Bogdan of Moldavia, Stephen the Great, Mircea the Elder, Michael the Brave, or Vlad the Impaler took part actively in the history of Central Europe by waging tumultuous wars and leading noteworthy crusades against the then continuously expanding Ottoman Empire, at times allied with either the Kingdom of Poland or the Kingdom of Hungary in these causes. Eventually the entire Balkan Peninsula was annexed by the Ottoman Empire. However, Moldavia and Wallachia extending to Dobruja and Bulgaria were not entirely subdued by the Ottomans as both principalities became autonomous which was not the case of other Ottoman territorial possessions in Europe. Transylvania, a third region inhabited by an important majority of Romanian speakers, was a vassal state of the Ottomans until 1687, when the principality became part of the Habsburg possessions. The three principalities were united for several months in 1600 under the authority of Wallachian Prince Michael the Brave. Additionally, in medieval times there were other lands known by the name Vlach, such as Great Valachia, situated between Thessaly and the western Pindus Mountains, originally within the Byzantine Empire, but after the 13th century autonomous or semi-independent, White Wallachia, a Byzantine denomination for the region between the Danube River and the Balkans, Moravian Wallachia, a region in southeastern Czech Republic. Up until 1541, Transylvania was part of the Kingdom of Hungary, later due to the conquest of Hungary by the Ottoman Empire was a self-governed principality governed by the Hungarian nobility. In 1699 it became a part of the Habsburg lands. By the 19th century, the Austrian Empire was awarded by the Ottomans with the region of Bukovina and, in 1812, the Russians occupied the eastern half of Moldavia, known as Bessarabia. Topic. Late modern age to contemporary era In the context of the 1848 Romanticist and liberal revolutions across Europe, the events that took place in the Grand Principality of Transylvania were the first of their kind to unfold in the Romanian-speaking territories. On the one hand, the Transylvanian Saxons and the Transylvanian Romanians with consistent support on behalf of the Austrian Empire successfully managed to oppose the goals of the Hungarian Revolution of 1848, with the two noteworthy historical figures leading the common Romanian-Saxon side at the time being Avram Iancu and Stefan Ludwig Roth. On the other hand, the Wallachian revolutions of 1821 and 1848 as well as the Moldavian Revolution of 1848, which aimed for independence from Ottoman and Russian foreign rulership, represented important impacts in the process of spreading the liberal ideology in the eastern and southern Romanian lands, in spite of the fact that all three eventually failed. Nonetheless, in 1859, Moldavia and Wallachia elected the same ruler, namely Alexander John Cusa who reigned as Domnitor and were thus unified de facto, resulting in the United Romanian Principalities for the period between 1859 and 1881. During the 1870s, the United Romanian Principalities then led by Hohenzollern Sigmaring and Domnitor Carol I fought a war of independence against the Ottomans, with Romania's independence being formally recognized in 1878 at the Treaty of Berlin. Although the newly founded Kingdom of Romania initially allied with Austria-Hungary, Romania refused to enter World War I on the side of the Central Powers, because it was obliged to wage war only if Austria-Hungary was attacked. In 1916, Romania joined the war on the side of the Triple Entente. 
As a result, at the end of the war, Transylvania, Bessarabia, and Bukovina were awarded to Romania, through a series of international peace treaties, resulting in an enlarged and far more powerful kingdom under King Ferdinand I. As of 1920, the Romanian people was believed to number over 15 million solely in the region of the Romanian Kingdom, a figure larger than the populations of Sweden, Denmark, and the Netherlands combined. During the interwar period, two additional monarchs came to the Romanian throne, namely Carol II and Michael I. First. This short-lived period was marked, at times, by political instabilities and efforts of maintaining a constitutional monarchy in favor of other, totalitarian regimes such as an absolute monarchy or a military dictatorship. During World War II, the Kingdom of Romania lost territory both to the east and west, as northern Transylvania became part of Hungary through the Second Vienna Award, while Bessarabia and northern Bukovina were taken by the Soviets and included in the Moldavian SSR, respectively Ukrainian SSR. The eastern territory losses were facilitated by the Molotov-Ribbentrop-German-Soviet non-aggression pact. After the end of the war, the Romanian kingdom managed to regain territories lost westward but was nonetheless not given Bessarabia and northern Bukovina, the aforementioned regions being forcefully incorporated into the Soviet Union. Subsequently, the Soviet Union imposed a communist government and King Michael was forced to abdicate and leave for exile. Nicolae Ceausescu became the head of the Romanian Communist Party in 1965 and his draconian rule of the 1980s was ended by the Romanian Revolution of 1989. The 1989 revolution brought to power the dissident communist Ion Iliescu. He remained in power as head of state until 1996, when he was defeated by CDR-supported Emil Constantinescu at the 1996 general elections, the first in post-communist Romania that saw a peaceful transition of power. Following Constantinescu's only term as president from 1996 to 2000, Iliescu was re-elected in late 2000 for another term of four years. In 2004, Traian Bisescu, the PNLPD candidate, was elected president. Five years later, Bisescu was narrowly re-elected for a second term at the 2009 presidential elections. In 2014, the PNLPDL candidate Klaus Johannes won a surprise victory over former Prime Minister and PSD-supported contender Victor Ponta in the second round of the 2014 presidential elections. Thus, Johannes became the first Romanian president stemming from an ethnic minority as he belongs to the Romanian-German community, being a Transylvanian Saxon. In the meantime, Romania's major foreign policy achievements were the alignment with Western Europe and the United States by joining the North Atlantic Treaty Organization in 2004 and the European Union three years later, in 2007. <laughs> Genetics The prevailing element in Wallachia, Ploiesti, Dolj, Moldavia, Piatra Nemt, Buhusi, Dobruja, Constanza, and Northern Republic of Moldova is recorded to be haplogroup I, while the gene pool of Transylvania is often untypical and diverse. According to self published data, the Y DNA haplogroup frequencies of 962 Romanians an unknown part of Moldovans are as follows 28% I2, 18% R1A, 15% R1B, 14% percent e one b one b 14 percent j2 4 percent i1 3 percent g2 a 2 percent n1 c 1 percent j1 1 percent t and q on the basis of 361 samples haplogroup i occurs at 32 percent in romanians the highest frequency of I2A1 IP37 in the Balkans today was present before the Slavic expansion and is owed to indigenous tribes, and is particularly suggested to have been common among the ancient Thracians in Romania. According to 335 sampled Romanians, 15% of them belong to R1A. Haplogroup R1A among Romanians is entirely from the Eastern European variety Z282 and may be a result of Baltic, Thracian or Slavic descent. R1A to Z280 outnumbers R1A M458 among Romanians. The opposite phenomena is typical for Poles, Czechs, and Bulgarians. 12% of the Romanians belong to R1B. The Alpino Italic branch R1B U152 is at 2% per 330 samples, a lower frequency recorded than other Balkan peoples. The branches R1BU106, R1BDF27 and R1BL21 make up 1% respectively. 
The eastern branches are 1BM269** and L23** make up 7% and outnumber the Atlantic branches, they prevail in parts of East, Central Europe and as a result of Greek colonization, in parts of Sicily as well. 8% of the Romanians belong to E1B1B1A1 EM78 per 265 samples, from a group of 178 males from nine Romanian counties, mainly from Transylvania, most of them belong to the Paleolithic European lineage I2A 17% I2A1B, 2% I2A2, 3% I2A2, 4% I2A2, 5% I2A2, 6% I2A2, 7% I2A2, 8% I2A2, 9% I2A2, 10% I2A2, 11% I2A2, 12% I2A2, 13% I2A2, 14% I2A2, 15% I2A2, 16% I2A2, 17% Haplogroup J2 is represented at 16% among them, unlike the structure in the Apennine Peninsula, among Romanians the J2B clade prevails. About 10% of these belong to haplogroup R1B in all counties. R1B U152, the specific Alpino Italic clade, is represented at 3% among them. The prevailing branches are eastern, except for Brasov, where Germanic U106 is most frequent. U-106 is also prevalent clade of R1B in Buhusi and Piatra Nunt. In Brasov and Dolj I-2 prevails, in Cluj, R1A. Another 6% of these belong to I-1 and 2% to G-2A. T, N, Q are also represented by frequencies of less than a percent. Despite negligible Roman genetic traits in general, one study of 219 Romanians found strong indications in other parts of Transylvania, in the region corresponding to Roman Dacia. The highest frequency of R1b in Eastern Europe only behind Trebich in the Czech Republic was found in the Romanian counties Arad and Alba, that experienced Celtic settlement, the heaviest and only Roman colonization with a significant number of colonists from Noricum and West Pannonia, and later German settlement. The subclade of R1b was not revealed in the case, but no similar high or prevailing frequency of eastern subclades of R1b has ever been found in Europe. Three of the ten towns that were almost exclusively populated by Roman citizens Apelum, Ampelum and Potaisa were in present Alba Iulia County, not far from the Roman capital Sarmazigetusa. Genetic isolate due to migration from unattested migration from the Middle East would not be a plausible historic geographical event as even the eastern branch of R1b in Europe is different than these in the Middle East. The only ethnic groups with higher frequencies of R1b in the East are the Aromanians due to their main ancestry from the Roman West. In some occasions the U-106 branch, which is minimal among Romanians, rises to the prevailing clade in some cities, but still at a low frequency. The high frequency of R1b was found in other places in Transylvania 25% in Marimers and Hargita, 20% in Mehadinti, 14% in Bihor, 11% in Vrancia, 0% in Nemt. Excluding Arad and Alba Iulia, haplogroup I plus G was found as most frequent in all, except Marimers, where haplogroup J was found to be prevalent. According to an autosomal analysis of Eastern Europeans and adjacent peoples, the group of Bulgarians and Macedonians is located together with Romanians. Most West Slavs, Hungarians, and Austrians tend to share as many identical by descent segments with South Slavs as with Romanians, Torbeshi and Gagazes, showing the importance of geography. A 2017 paper, concentrating on the mtDNA, signaling how Romania has been a major crossroads between Asia and Europe, and thus experienced continuous migration and invasion episodes, while praising that previous studies show Romanians exhibit genetic similarity with other Europeans, are that another study pointed to possible segregation within the Middle East populations, also mentions how Signals of Asian maternal lineages were observed in all Romanian historical provinces, indicating gene flow along the migration routes through East Asia and Europe, during different time periods, namely, the Upper Paleolithic period and or, with a likely greater preponderance, the Middle Ages," and concludes that our current findings based on the mtDNA analysis of populations in historical provinces of Romania suggest similarity between populations in Transylvania and Central Europe." On one hand, as well between Wallachia, Moldavia, and Dobruja with the Balkans, on the another, "...supported both by the observed clines in haplogroup frequencies for several European and Asian maternal lineages and MDS analyses." 
Topic: <laughs> Language The origins of the Romanian language, a Romance language, can be traced back to the Roman colonization of the region. The basic vocabulary is of Latin origin, although there are some substratum words that are sometimes assumed to be of Dacian origin. Romanian language has retained the inflected structure of Latin grammar. During the Middle Ages, Romanian was isolated from the other Romance languages, and borrowed words from the nearby Slavic languages see Slavic influence on Romanian. Later on, it borrowed a number of words from German, Hungarian, and Turkish. During the modern era, most neologisms were borrowed from French and Italian, though the language has increasingly begun to adopt English borrowings. The Moldovan language, in its official form, is practically identical to Romanian, although there are some differences in colloquial speech. In the de facto independent but internationally unrecognized region of Transnistria, the official script used to write Moldovan is Cyrillic. As of 2017, an ethnologue estimation puts the worldwide number of Romanian speakers at approximately 24.15 million. The 24.15 million, however, represent only speakers of Romanian, not all of whom are necessarily ethnic Romanians. Also, this number does not include ethnic Romanians who no longer speak the Romanian language. Topic. Surnames. Many Romanian surnames have the suffix escu or less commonly ascu or ascu which corresponds to the Latin suffix iscus and means belonging to the people. For example, Petrescu used to be Petrus Keen. Similar suffixes such as asco, asgo, esc, ez, etc. are present in other Latin-derived languages. Many Romanians in France change this ending of their surnames to Esco, because the way it is pronounced in French better approximates the Romanian pronunciation of ESCU. Another widespread suffix of Romanian surnames is EANU, or an, anu, which indicates the geographical origin. Here some examples, Moldovanu, Moldovan, Moldovanu, from the region of Moldavia or from River Moldova, Muntianu, from mountains, Gianu, from Jew River region. Prutianu, meaning from the Prut River, Marizanu, meaning from the Muresh River, Petrianu, meaning the son of Petra, etc. Other suffixes are Aru or Oru, R, or, which indicates an occupation like Ferraru, Smith, Morar, Miller, and A, usually preceded by A in front of a female name, which is a Latin inherited female genitive, like in Amarie, of Maria, Alene, of Elena. These matrilineal rooted surnames are common in the historical region of Moldavia. The most common surnames are Pop, Popa, the priest. Almost 200,000 Romanians have this surname, Popescu, son of the priest. Almost 150,000 have this name, and Ionescu, John's Ion's son. Topic: <laughs> Names for Romanians. In English, Romanians are usually called Romanians, Rumanians, or Romanians except in some historical texts, where they are called Romans or Vlachs. Etymology of the name Romanian Roman. From the Middle Ages, Romanians bore two names, the exonym one given to them by foreigners Wallachians or Vlachs, under its various forms Vlah, Vala, Valak, Volo, Black, Ala, Vlas, Ilac, Eula, etc., and the endonym the name they used for themselves Romanians Rumani, Romani, the name Romanian is derived from Latin Romanus. Under regular phonetical changes that are typical to the Romanian languages, the name Romanus over the centuries transformed into Rumen, Ru -men. an older form of Roman, was still in use in some regions. Sociolinguistic evolutions in the late 18th century led to a gradual preponderance of the Roman spelling form, which was then generalized during the national awakening of Romania of early 19th century. Until the 19th century, the term Romanian denoted the speakers of the Daco-Romanian dialect of the Romanian language, thus being a much more distinct concept than that of Romania, the country of the Romanians. Prior to 1867, the Daco Romanians were part of different statal entities, with the Moldavians and the Wallachians being split off and having shaped separate political identities, possessing states of their own, and with the rest of Romanians being part of other states. However, they retained their Romanian cultural and ethnic identity. 
Topic: <laughs> Daco-Romanian. To distinguish Romanians from the other Romanic peoples of the Balkans Aromanians, Meglenno-Romanians, and Istro-Romanians, the term Daco-Romanian is sometimes used to refer to those who speak the standard Romanian language and live in the territory of ancient Dacia today comprising mostly Romania and Moldova, although some Daco-Romanians can be found in the eastern part of central Serbia which was part of ancient Mosia. <laughs> Etymology of the term Vlach The name of Vlox is an exonym that was used by Slavs to refer to all Romanized natives of the Balkans. It holds its origin from ancient Germanic being a cognate to Welsh and Walloon, and perhaps even further back in time, from the Roman name Volsi, which was originally a Celtic tribe. From the Slavs, it was passed on to other peoples, such as the Hungarians and Greeks. See the etymology section of Vlox. Wallachia, the southern region of Romania, takes its name from the same source. Nowadays, the term Vlach is more often used to refer to the Romanized populations of the Balkans who speak Daco-Romanian, Aromanian, Istro-Romanian and Megleno-Romanian. Anthroponyms These are family names that have been derived from either Vlach or Romanian. Most of these names have been given when a Romanian settled in a non-Romanian region. Examples, Ala 37,147 Hungarians have this name, Vlach, Vlahuda, Vlasa, Vlasi, Vlasic, Vlascianu, Vlacopolis, Volo, Voli, Vlac, Flac and Vlax. <laughs> Romanians outside Romania Most Romanians live in Romania, where they constitute a majority. Romanians also constitute a minority in the countries that neighbor Romania. Romanians can also be found in many countries, notably in the other EU countries, particularly in Italy, Spain, Germany, the United Kingdom, and France, in North America, in the United States and Canada, in Israel, as well as in Brazil, Australia, Argentina, and New Zealand, among many other countries. Italy and Spain have been popular emigration destinations, due to a relatively low language barrier, and both are each now home to about a million Romanians. With respect to geopolitical identity, many individuals of Romanian ethnicity in Moldova prefer to identify themselves as Moldovans. The contemporary total population of ethnic Romanians cannot be stated with any degree of certainty. A disparity can be observed between official sources such as census counts where they exist, and estimates which come from non-official sources and interested groups. Several inhibiting factors not unique to this particular case contribute towards this uncertainty, which may include A degree of overlap may exist or be shared between Romanian and other ethnic identities in certain situations, and census or survey respondents may elect to identify with one particular ancestry but not another, or instead identify with multiple ancestries. Counts and estimates may inconsistently distinguish between Romanian nationality and Romanian ethnicity, i.e., not all Romanian nationals identify with Romanian ethnicity, and vice versa. The measurements and methodologies employed by governments to enumerate and describe the ethnicity and ancestry of their citizens vary from country to country. Thus the census definition of Romanian might variously mean Romanian born, of Romanian parentage, or also include other ethnic identities as Romanian which otherwise are identified separately in other contexts, for example, the decennial U.S. Census of 2000 calculated based on a statistical sampling of household data that there were 367,310 respondents indicating Romanian ancestry roughly 0.1% of the total population, the actual total recorded number of foreign-born Romanians was only 130 36,000 migration information source however, some non-specialist organizations have produced estimates which are considerably higher. A 2002 study by the Romanian American Network Inc. mentions an estimated figure of 1,200,000 for the number of Romanian Americans. This estimate notes however that other immigrants of Romanian national minority groups have been included such as, Armenians, Germans, Gypsies, Hungarians, Jews, and Ukrainians." It also includes an unspecified allowance for second- and third-generation Romanians, and an indeterminate number living in Canada. An error range for the estimate is not provided. 
For the United States 2000 census figures, almost 20% of the total population did not classify or report an ancestry, and the census is also subject to undercounting, an incomplete 67% response rate, and sampling error in general. Topic: Culture. Topic: Contributions to humanity. Romanians have played and contributed a major role in the advancement of the arts, culture, sciences, technology and engineering. In the history of aviation, Trian Vuya and Oral Vlaku built and tested some of the earliest aircraft designs, while Henri Coanda discovered the Coanda effect of fluidics. Victor Babes discovered more than 50 germs and a cure for a disease named after him, babesiosis. Biologist Nicolae Paulescu discovered insulin. Another biologist, Emil Palade, received the Nobel Prize for his contributions to cell biology. George Constantinescu created the theory of sonics, while mathematician Stefan Odobleja is regarded as the ideological father behind cybernetics. His work The Consonantist Psychology Paris, 1938, was the main source of inspiration for N. Wiener's Cybernetics Paris, 1948. Lazar Edelianu was the first chemist to synthesize amphetamine and also invented the modern method of refining crude oil. In the arts and culture, prominent figures were George Inescu, music composer, violinist, professor of Sir Yehudi Menuhin, Constantine Brancusi, sculptor, Eugene Ionesco, playwright, Mircea Iliadi, historian of religion and novelist, Emile Cioran, essayist, Prix de l'Institut Français for Stylism, and Angela Gorgio, soprano. More recently, filmmakers such as Christy Puyu and Christian Munju have attracted international acclaim, as has fashion designer Ioana Cholacu. In sports, Romanians have excelled in a variety of fields, such as football Gheorghe Hagi, gymnastics Nadia Kamenici, Lavinia Milosevici etc. Tennis Ili Nastase, Ion Tiriak, Simona Halep, canoe racing Ivan Patsychin, and handball four times men's World Cup winners. Count Dracula is a worldwide icon of Romania. This character was created by the Irish fiction writer Bram Stoker, based on some stories spread in the late Middle Ages by the frustrated German trademen of Kronstadt Brasov and on some vampire folk tales about the historic Romanian figure of Prince Vlad Tepes. Religion Almost 90% of all Romanians consider themselves religious. The vast majority are Eastern Orthodox Christians, belonging to the Romanian Orthodox Church a branch of Eastern Orthodoxy, or Eastern Orthodox Church, together with the Greek Orthodox, Orthodox Church of Georgia and Russian Orthodox Churches, among others. According to the 2011 census, 93.6% of ethnic Romanians in Romania identified themselves as Romanian Orthodox in comparison to 86.8% .8 of Romania's total population, including other ethnic groups. However, the actual rate of church attendance is significantly lower and many Romanians are only nominally believers. For example, according to a 2006 Eurobarometer poll, only 23% of Romanians attend church once a week or more. A 2006 poll conducted by the Open Society Foundation found that only 33% of Romanians attended church once a month or more. Romanian Catholics are present in Transylvania, Banat, Bukovina, Bucharest, and parts of Moldavia, belonging to both the Roman Catholic Church 297,246 members and the Romanian Greek Catholic Catholic Church 124,563 members. According to the 2011 census, 2.5% of ethnic Romanians in Romania identified themselves as Catholic in comparison to 4.3% of Romania's total population, including other ethnic groups. Around 1.6% of ethnic Romanians in Romania identify themselves as Pentecostal, with the population numbering 276,678 members. Smaller percentages are Protestant, Jews, Muslims, agnostic, atheist, or practice a traditional religion. There are no official dates for the adoption of religions by the Romanians. Based on linguistic and archaeological findings, historians suggest that the Romanians' ancestors acquired polytheistic religions in the Roman era, later adopting Christianity, certainly by the 4th century CE when decreed by Emperor Constantine as the official religion of the Roman Empire. 
Like in all other Romance languages, the basic Romanian words related to Christianity are inherited from Latin, such as God Dumnezeu Basarica, Cruz Inger Sfan T Crichun Creston Paste Picat Aboteza. Priat Aruga. Credenta. After the Great Schism, there existed a Catholic bishopric of Cumania later, separate bishoprics in both Wallachia and Moldavia. However, this seems to be the exception, rather than the rule, as in both Wallachia and Moldavia the state religion was Eastern Orthodox. Until the 17th century, the official language of the liturgy was Old Church Slavonic. Then, it gradually changed to Romanian. According to a survey that took place in 2011, despite 94% of respondents answered positively for believing in God, 42% support the vision of Christian dogma that there is a God incarnated into a human being. While 34% of respondents said that there is only one true religion, 38% believe that there is one true religion and that other religions contain some basic truths, according to 18% there is one true religion and all major world religions contain some fundamental truths. 88% of Romanians believe in the existence of a soul, 87% believe in sin and the existence of heaven, 60% believe in an evil eye, 25% believe in horoscopes and 23% in aliens. According to a 2004 survey, 80% consider themselves not superstitious and the same amount believe in angels, about 40% believe they have had dreams that became déjà vu and 19% believe in ghosts. Topic symbols In addition to the colors of the Romanian flag, each historical province of Romania has its own characteristic symbol, Banat, Trajan's Bridge Dobruja, Dolphin Moldavia including Bukovina and Bessarabia, Aurochs, Wizant Oltenia, Lion Transylvania, Black Eagle or Tural Wallachia, Eagle The coat of arms of Romania combines these together. Topic customs Topic Relationship to other ethnic groups The closest ethnic groups to the Romanians are the other Romanic peoples of southeastern Europe, the Aromanians Macedo Romanians, the Megleno Romanians, and the Istro Romanians. The Istro Romanians are the closest ethnic group to the Romanians, and it is believed they left Marimers, Transylvania about a thousand years ago and settled in Istria, Croatia. Numbering about 500 people still living in the original villages of Istria while the majority left for other countries after World War II mainly to Italy, United States, Canada, Germany, France, Sweden, Switzerland, and Australia, they speak the Istro-Romanian language, the closest living relative of Romanian. The Aromanians and the Megleno-Romanians are Romanic peoples who live south of the Danube, mainly in Greece, Albania and the Republic of Macedonia, although some of them migrated to Romania in the 20th century. It is believed that they diverged from the Romanians in the 7th to 9th century, and currently speak the Aromanian language and Megleno-Romanian language, both of which are Eastern Romance languages, like Romanian, and are sometimes considered by traditional Romanian linguists to be dialects of Romanian. Gallery See also Notes and references External links A Concise History of Romanians The Romanian Nation in the Beginning of the Twentieth Century